Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Classic Coco, and we are with another episode of Let's Be Real, the podcast. Hey, so we got one of my Ram fam in a building. Jared, what it is? What what's it good? Do? What's good? What's good? How are you today? I am blessed. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. So I know you're doing some a lot of big things, and I know that you are starting your cookbook. Yes. yes so yes. let me know a little bit about that. Yeah. Um, again, my name is Jared Goins. I am co-authoring a cookbook um, named Friendsgiving, and it really is inspired by an event that I host every year mm -hmm. called Friendsgiving. Uh, this will be my six, uh, six year hosting Friendsgiving, and really uh, the inspiration really came to me in a low place where I was unemployed, and mm -hmm. um, I was just in a creative space. I was doing a lot of freelance graphic design, and I really wanted to pour into my brand. Mm -hmm. And I do a lot of things for people, you know, flyers, graphic design. I do websites, um, business marketing consultation. And I really wanted to create something that could be beneficial to them uh, health-wise and also um, just give inspiration because how many times do you think about what's for dinner? Right. <laughs> what are we going to eat? What are we going to eat? <laughs> yeah. That's probably the, the most talked about topic in the house home. And I was trying to come up with something that was creative uh, that would really be beneficial and fun to do. Mm -hmm. And this is a big collabor uh, collaborative. Um, so, again, I was sharing with you that I am co-authoring. I have my other co-author out of Houston, Texas. We were on the phone during that low time. We were just chatting it up, you know, talking every day. She was in a position where she really was unhappy. I was in a position where I was kind of about to get into stage of depression almost. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I had to lift myself out. I, I really rely on my faith in God, all glory to God for Amen. his vision. Yes. Um, because without him, I would have not seen it through. I would have, you know, went into a lot of self doubt. And, you know, I, I'm just looking forward to this big collaboration. Yes. So when can we expect the release of Friendsgiving? Yeah, so Friendsgiving, I actually just hosted my first tasting yesterday. Mm -hmm. Oh. And so the the vision really came from and are inspired by pescatarian and vegan options. Mm -hmm. So uh, Friendsgiving will be a collaboration with uh, two sides of the kitchen. You know, you have your vegan side and you have your pescatarians. And just really learning about the alternatives that we have. Uh, so the first tasting was yesterday. Just to answer the question, we are also launching an ebook initially, and that's going to be at the end of August. We're going to launch our first ebook, and after that, we're going to continue to offer meal prep ideas and just really start reaching out to people personally, you know, by word of mouth and mm -hmm. by social media, just so people can understand what the brand is. And officially, we are going to release our physical copies of the cookbook on the actual day of quote unquote Friendsgiving, mm -hmm. um, November the 11th, 11, 11. So you'll learn a lot more about that event is going to be a big collaboration with different cooks and people who just enjoy cooking. Hey, and where can we find you on all social media platforms to stay tapped into what you have going on? Yeah. So on Instagram and Twitter is Mr. Goins on Instagram is Mr. Dot Goins. Mm -hmm. uh, and my business page is, uh, Friendsgiving Eats, mm -hmm. and that's Eats with an S, not a Z. Okay. <laughs> so, hey. uh, you know, you can be able to find me on Instagram, and we're actually about to start moving to other platforms. We're about to start moving to YouTube, and um, I know YouTube Shorts is a big uh, push right now for creatives, and uh, TikTok, we're trying to move over to TikTok as well in the next mm -hmm. few uh, weeks. We're also recording a mini series. Mm -hmm. Uh, which is going to be a, a collaboration with people who attend the private tastings and the public tastings to create some content and conversation around what the cookbook is about. Um, so it's going to be very exciting just to be able to see people's reactions and uh, be able to taste recipes that are in the cookbook. Hey, well, listen, thank you so much for coming on Let's Be Real the podcast. Of course, of course. I'm staying tuned in with the Friendsgiving cookbook because I love to eat. Yes. I'm actually <laughs> trying to get more uh, in a more cleaner type of eating. Yeah. So pescatarian, yeah. vegan type options is definitely what I'm looking for. Yeah. So y'all make sure y'all tap in with Mr. Goins, another Ram fam. Make sure y'all tap in with Friendsgiving. Cop that when it comes out, ebook and everything. And stay tuned with me with the events and everything because I love to put it out there. Of course, I and appreciate everything. it. No yeah. problem. Well, y'all, it's your girl, Classic Coco. We have another episode of Let's Be Real, the podcast. We lit. Y'all have a good one.
Shady. 